Uh, how you guys doing? We're gonna do a quick little video this time. It's sunny outside, so figured we'll do some outside type activity. We're gonna be doing tie-dye shirts. I got this box kit from uh, Five and Below. We already got the white t-shirts soaking. We got a couple white t-shirts to throw in there. We're gonna do a bunch of different things. We're just doing this for fun. Hopefully you guys enjoy. These are the colors we got. That is hard to see right now, but that is red. Red, orange, yellow, green, turquoise, blue, purple, pink. And we're gonna be using that bucket so we don't get a mess everywhere. We're letting the t-shirt soak in the water right now. And it comes with instructions, so definitely read the instructions. It came with little things to tie it up, but we're gonna be using our rubber bands. Okay, so I'm gonna to attempt to do what's called sunburst. Um, so, <laughs> I've never done it this way, and it says to grab a bunch. And just rubber band it to make sure they're roughly about four inches apart from each other. And once you do that, you pick your two colors, and you're supposed to apply the one color to the nipples and then the other color to the rest of the shirt and therefore you get what's called the sunburst effect but hey if i fail at least you get to see what not to do i on my gloves here because i'm not trying to stain up my tattoo or so i'm going to be using um the blue and the green tie-dye colors um, and it says place it inside the starburst and squeeze. Um, so I'm just going to place it like that and give it a bit of a squeeze. Because it's like not supposed to be... Ooh, and that just shot all over me. You're not supposed to be like dyeing the whole nipple or anything. It's supposed to be like just a burst of color inside there and then a different color added. All right, so it just says for this color, just to place it on. And I'm gonna try not to get it in the, um, the burst. And I'm trying not to use all the green either for the simple fact that my son wanted the green. All right. And I think I'm gonna call that quits. Okay, so we're gonna attempt the swirl technique, like I said. Um, that we're pretty much everybody's used to doing and this is going to be my um, little toddler guy's shirt so it's really small what colors Lonnie do you think we should do for Roman hmm. I can do four different colors I would do turquoise that's turquoise yeah. yellow, yellow orange and blue or green sorry how about red? That works. Because I have to save some green for, for June bug. All right, so we'll put this in here for a second. Take the red off. And I'm just going to ever so kindly dump red dye. All right, next is orange. All right, hit it up with the yellow. Now hit it up finally with some turquoise. All right. And then it says to seal them up in little plastic baggies. Yada, yada, yada. Since we like to recycle in this house, we're just going to take a grocery bag. And personally, since there's just so little, I'm probably going to have to twist it. It says something about it should be airtight, yada, 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 all this other fancy crap. But I just put them in a bag, twist it up tight, and tie it. All right, shirts are done. We're gonna show you guys how they all came out from the tie-dye we, we did the other night. Washed them with cold water, then washed them with warm water. That's what you guys did. And then uh, we finished them off by drying them in the dryer. So they're done. So we're gonna show you all of them, and you guys can decide whether you guys like them or not. There's one of them right there. There's 
There's another one we did with the green and the orange. And the teal. Nickelodeon. Nickelodeon style. I think that one stuffs. I think that's the one I did. This is the one I did. I did a little bit of each color. I just kind of threw it all together. That's how that one came out. The little tank top we did for stuff. And we got people beeping the horn in the background. <laughs> this is our smallest son's shirt. We think this one came out real good and has swirls. And there's another one. All in all, we did all these shirts and uh, we still had dye left. We also have another tie-dye kit that we'll probably do in a future video. That's a lot bigger than this one. So, I heard another tank top. And here's the one that Steph did by just pinching them and tying them up and squirting a little bit on it. So that's all our tie-dye. Hope you guys like that little experience. Change it up a little bit. We like posting random stuff. Uh, let us know if you guys like content like this. Give us a thumbs up. Turn on post notifications. Spread the word and appreciate it. Stay tuned. Giveaways coming soon. Thank you. Till next time. Later.